Hey guys, at home, you're probably doing lunges until the cows come home, you might have only got a set of dumbbells like I've got here. But did you actually know that there's a couple of different ways you can do lunges to hit either the front of the legs or the glute hamstrings? The first one is more of a hip flexion based lunge where we're taking a long step. So you'll see on this one that I'm taking a nice and long step. I'm still bending at the knee but I'm trying to limit it and I'm focused on squeezing my glute as I stand. The second one is going to be more of a shorter step that's going to target more of the quad. So as you can see here I'm taking a smaller step and I'm really allowing that knee to bend, pushing more from the midfoot as I stand. You'll see the difference between the two lunges here, one at which I'm a bit more upright and the knee isn't quite as bent, and the other one which I'm allowing the knee to bend a little bit more and allow that knee to track over the toes. So you might only have like one set, it might be a far too light for you and you're thinking but Vaughn how can I actually make that harder? Well I would always combat it with something like a wall sit and do that first to pre-exhaust. So if you want to target the gluten hamstrings I would simply get on the wall and I would have my feet quite far away. So again it's mimicking that same sort of angle we were doing on the lunge. If you want to target more of the quads what you could do is just have a closer stance and come a little bit further down here. So if you come around you'll see that that bent angle at the knee is similar to what I was doing with the lunge.